How to succeed when your loved ones don't believe in you. What's worse than being ignored by your loved ones, especially when their support will go a long way as far as chasing your dreams and becoming successful is concerned? Of course, it will be frustrating, especially on days when you need someone to tell you how well you've been doing and how much they believe in your abilities to achieve what you want to achieve. Those days you need someone to express how proud you've made them become and how excited they are to be associated with you. But remember, Roy T. Burnett, chairman of the Ohio Republican Party and one of the three Ohio representatives to the Republican National Committee said, and I quote, Don't let others tell you what you can't do. Don't let the limitations of others limit your vision. If you can remove your self-doubt and believe in yourself, you can achieve what you never thought possible. Also, according to Rochelle E. Goodrich, you may be the only person left who believes in you. But it's enough. It takes just one star to pierce a universe of darkness. Never give up. In this video, I'll share with you how to succeed when your loved ones don't believe in you. This, I believe, will help you become a successful person. If you're new here, consider subscribing so that you won't miss other interesting videos like this. 1. Don't argue or try to convince them. Most times, when your loved ones don't support your entrepreneur's dream, it is not because they don't believe in you or what you're building. They are just scared and trying to protect you from what they consider risky. They are not bad people who want to destroy your dreams, they just don't understand why you do what you do. So they voice out their concerns. In other cases, it may be plain ignorance or simply trying to pass on their insecurities to you. In such a situation, rather than take it to heart and start an argument, understand that despite their tone, they may not necessarily mean bad for you. So don't bother arguing or trying to convince them when you can invest that same energy into building your business. You can listen to their concerns, but don't feel disheartened. Explain your point to them in a calm manner. Explain to them that it is important for you to at least give your entrepreneurial dreams a try because you don't want to live your life with regrets. But don't argue. If they don't understand now, give them some time. They may understand later. 2. Always believe in yourself and your purpose. Roy T. Burnett said and I quote, The more you believe in yourself, the more you could trust yourself. The more you trust yourself, the less you compare yourself to others. When you believe in yourself and your vision, whether people support you or not, you'll be able to overcome obstacles and you'll get it. Your passion should always be your priority. 3. Surround yourself with those who get it. In a situation where your loved ones aren't supportive of your dreams, then you should surround yourself with people who understand what it means to be an entrepreneur and what it takes to build a business. If possible, surround yourself with people who are in a similar field. American media executive, actress and talk show host Oprah Winfrey once said, surround yourself with only people who are going to lift you higher. You can join an entrepreneur's club, a mastermind group or you can find a mentor. The goal is to surround yourself with people who are seeing your vision and support your dreams. According to Success Toro, make a conscious effort to surround yourself with positive nourishing and uplifting people. People who believe in you, encourage you to go after your dreams and applaud your victories. When you do not surround yourself with people who are positive and positive about your dreams, you might end up getting discouraged and tempted to give up. We all need support when chasing our dreams. So, if you are not getting that at home or around your loved ones, then you can create a community or join a community of supporters and motivators. 4. Take action. Once you believe in yourself, in your vision, and you've surrounded yourself with the right people who will constantly push you to keep going when everything gets tough, the next agenda on the list should be to take action. Taking action means putting specific plans in place to help you succeed and working hard towards achieving your goals. Alan Lackian, 
a well-known author on personal time management, said planning is bringing the future into the present so that you can do something about it now. An action involves making plans, which is then executed by working towards it. Part of making plans involves setting budgets and taking strategic risks. Colin Powell, an American politician and retired four-star general in the United States Army, said, and I quote, there are no secrets to success. It's a result of preparation, hard work, and learning from failure. Be committed to your dreams. Take massive steps to achieve massive results. In the end, your loved ones will be proud of you and you'd have earned their support even beyond what you initially asked for. Always remember that success starts with you. If you can dream it, you can do it. Walt Disney So, irrespective of what anyone says or believes, keep moving, stay motivated and never give up. Success usually comes to those who are too busy to be looking for it. Henry David Thoreau Thank you very much for watching our videos. We'd like to give you another interesting video for you to enjoy next. But before then, our team will be very happy if you can like this video and share it with your friends on social media. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Look at your screen now to see two other videos we handpicked for you to enjoy next. We love you.